Welcome back to Skyrim Survival Adventure. This is episode 98. Finally, back on Souls time. It's been far too long. I did not hit up the shops in Windhelm because it was evening. So many things to do here. Not doing any of those things, although I could uh, talk to Margaret, convince him to take half or something, but eh, let's see. My current blessing is close to expiring anyway, so I might as well get some extra magic resistance. Attendant, why has the door to the lower level been locked? Locked? Are you certain, Elder? Of course I'm certain. I wished to bless the tombs with the monthly invocation, but I couldn't get the door to open. I'm certain it's only stuck, Elder. I'll speak to Glover Mallory and see if he can take a look at it. Never heard that conversation before. Then again, I don't... Hang around the temple a whole lot. Let's see. Starting stuff watch. I have things to do in Telmetrin. You can go where you please, but I'd say stay inside the bulwark if I were you. Yeah, well, you're not me. It's Rallis's problem now. It's Rallis's problem now. Yeah, this is the one where there were actual survivors. <coughs> uh, if it weren't for the comfort brought by my invisible friend, I would have fled this place long ago. I wish I had realized earlier that it was not a group, but a monster who contains multitudes. He's guided me into a true understanding of the barrow, and I greatly desire to meet with him. My insight to this, into this place is now so intuitive, so fundamental, that I almost feel like, feel as if I built it myself. I explained to the workers how to use the tile set, but they seem too afraid or uncoordinated to properly step on each tile quickly enough. No problems. Nothing that the master cannot solve. We will be able to converse properly soon enough. I suppose I should stop talk to Rallis. Oh, I was hoping I wouldn't see you quite so soon. It's been over a week since I got your message. It looks like at least some of the miners survived this time. Yes, well, the mercenaries did their jobs. Worth every septum. Of course, they might disagree. The dead ones, anyway. Gods, what a disaster. I feel like we've done this before. But that just means we're getting good at it. 
You go make the Draugr dead again, and I'll keep the rest of these Enwars from running off. Okay, but I'm gonna do that later. I am itching to get to Telmithrin. Yeah, it is night time, I can see the stars. Still need to get in there and kill the general. Fort Frostmoth will never fall. Long live the Empire! need more than one word I guess but there is a way to bypass most of it by going from tower to tower uh, but it might have been from that tower up to there anyway I still want to go to bed tell Mithrin. save once in a while 
in case the game crashes, if nothing else. Where's the third one? Oh. It's two nearly on top of each other. Okay. Uh, time is 3 a.m. Well, I can at least get Nello to remove that memory trace spell of his. Everything that can go wrong is going wrong. Ash spawn attacks my house, and even my steward is assassinated. It's as if Telmithran is cursed. Spoiled fool. Ash spawn attack. Rude having a conversation with each other when Next time, don't I'm trying to talk to you. If you can't do it properly. Are we done? I thought so. <sighs> hmm? I examine the Bray Heart Warrior. Oh, have you? Well, let me just extract those memories and I'll see if you found anything useful. I promise that any unrelated memories I run across will be kept in the strictest of confidences. Here, you deserve a bit of a reward for your efforts. That was a lengthy trip for you, I'm sure. Okay. My new steward is acceptable. If only he made better tea. There are too many coincidences. There must be someone behind all of my recent troubles. Hmm. Now I don't have the where is everyone option. What did you learn from the Briarheart? A connecting soul thread is knotted three times. Once for the heart, once for the spirit, and once for the body. The knot gives the connection a strength. That may be the key that I've been looking for. Do you need help with your research? I suppose that depends. Are you willing to be an experimental subject? Uh, if it's not too risky, what kind of experiment do you want to do on me? Oh, nothing too dangerous. It should provide an additional spectral tether from your own life spark to the Adric realm. You would experience it as a sort of increased vigor. You would fight longer, feel stronger, that sort of thing. At least I think it will, probably, almost certainly. Of course, you never can tell. I'd be glad to help. Now stand still. 
It's my first time casting this spell, and I don't need any additional distractions. You won't feel a thing, but if you do, try not to scream too loudly. My ears are sensitive. Off you go. If you discover any side effects, come back and tell me straight away. Uh, now let's health boost. 25 points. I thought I, I thought I had 300. I do have 300 standard. Okay, um... There are too many coincidences. There must be someone behind all of my recent troubles. Someone is attacking you? Yes, I have enemies. Legions of them back in Morrowind. However, in this case, I have reason to believe it is someone in Solstein. I suppose you want me to kill them. Not yet. That may come later, but first I need to identify the culprit. I've enchanted this ring to find the source of the attacks. Here, take it. How does the ring work? Just wear it. It will light up the source when you get close to it. I enchanted the ring with a bit of ash from the last ash spawn attack. It can follow the magical link back to its summoner. How close do I have to be? The link is weak, so you'll have to be within about a hundred feet of the source. Uh, how do you know you're under attack? Ash spawn keep appearing. One night, a part of my tower mysteriously withered. Then my steward was killed. You had to find me a replacement. I've even been attacked by dragons. Do I need to go on? I'm not sure the dragons are about you. Maybe not. I hear they've been seen over Skyrim, too. Even so, there is more than enough evidence that someone is out to get me. Try walking around the grounds with the ring on. Don't lose that ring. It was difficult to make. Mm. I suppose I could dig up a staff or two for you. Hmm. I can probably buy some soul gems. Good day, friend. Keeping well? Mm-hmm. Oh, did you need something? What do you got for sale? So, you wish to master the arcane arts? I have everything. Actually... Yes, let's just all gems. I need those. I'll just... take everything. All right, then. Mm, dragons. Master Neloth says they are no match for a Telvanni wizard. But what about a mere apprentice? Uh, am I allowed to sleep anywhere here yet? not I 
guess I should wear uh, the ring. Emulator, I th think those are grand souls. The challenger is near. Uh, how many? Let's see, a sewer star is empty. I have twelve empty grand soul gems. No match at all. Grand soul. Forgot to change back to my uh, combat gear. If you're going to be up here, stay out of my way. I mm. found it. This hearthstone is the source of the attacks. Hmm. I've known for decades that hearthstones will animate the ash, but it would have to be very close by. Where exactly did you find this hearthstone? It was in Ildari Sarothril's grave. Ildari. Then it was my own fault. She was my apprentice before Talus. She volunteered for one of my experiments involving heartstones. I'll make sure not to do that it then. It was quite annoying when she died. Uh, experiment? What did you do to her? My necropsies of Spriggans led me to believe that a heartstone could be implanted in a person's chest, granting them great power. I was considering replacing my heart with a heartstone. Fortunately, Ildari offered to let me operate on her first. Of course, this was before your Briarheart expedition. Now I know that I did the surgery all wrong. There wasn't a body in the grave, just the heartstone. What? And a stuff. Impossible. Wait, unless she didn't actually die, the heartstone could have kept her right at the edge of life and death. Could it be? Could Ildari? Still be alive. Could she be my nemesis? Wait a moment while I cast a more specific divination. One day I will inherit his power. It will all be mine. Mark my and stars. Ildare Sarothril, reveal yourself. She lives. Seek her in High Point Tower. So, Ildari does live, after all. She thought she could hide from me, but she can't. She's holed up in High Point Tower. Go rip that thrice cursed heart stone from her chest. Ah, uh, why don't you do this? Why me? I don't have time to go traipsing all over Solstheim. If I don't hear back from you after a while, you're probably dead. Maybe I'll send Talvis out next. Uh, okay. 
Be sure to bring back an amusing story of how Ildori died. Putting common souls in greater soul gems now. Funny. Uh, time almost morning. Let me know if you see anything you like. I don't care if he's a master wizard. He can't treat me like this. So if Tapper is planted. Good. Now maybe Neloth will get off my back about it. I suppose you think you should get paid for helping an old woman. I mean, that would be Here, nice. Take these. I'll sell you more if you come back later. Oh, uh, what can you tell me about Ildari Sarotril? She was a headstrong one. Always pushing Master Neloth to teach her more. Her lust for power was her undoing. She let Master Neloth do some ritual thing to her. We buried her out back. That was some 20 years ago now. I probably have some potions around here that might interest you. Zora, light your steps. Anything else nearby or... Hmm. I mean, I want to go kill that uh, dragon up. Fanadi, stop it. Up there. If 
Panari. Azura's wisdom to you, friend. After what you did for me, you are always welcome here. Just try to stay out of Master Nailoth's way. Do you owe Mogrel money? Uh, well, sort of. I owed him a thousand septums, but not anymore. He doesn't dare try to collect now that I'm Nailoth's steward. Except now he expects me to pay him. Wow, sorry about that. He's never gonna stop, you know. He'll keep sending thugs after you until either you pay him or kill him. Why don't you just pay him? Pay him? Why? I mean, I don't have the money. Well, I might soon. Nailoth does pay well. But the important thing is, I don't have it. In fact, it's not likely I'll ever have it. Expenses, you know. Sorry about the thugs and Mogrel and everything. You should pay me what you can. Well, I... Oh, fine. Here, this is all I have. Okay. Until next time. Yes. And dash off. Pretty sure I did castle trap and it's still active, but you know, just to make sure. Hmm, what's my summon doing? Fanari? Fanari, stop. me like that. What were you doing? I mean, presumably killing one of them. have come south to test our worth against the mighty Netch. Will you join us? Sounds fun. I'll join your hunt. Well met, friend. May we all fight or die well. Mercy 
on you. I'll paint the snow with your blood. Die, damn you! I'll carve you into pieces. I love a good fight. Yeah, the they hit me. Uh. Is that the net we're killing? We hunt not only to eat, but also to test our skill. If the All Maker favors us, we will eat well for many days. Uh, you're selling stuff? Take a look. Eyes be sharp and your aim true. The if wise you come here to hunt, always. there is plenty of game to be found. So, are we going to kill an edge or. Most of the game has been driven north by the ash bomb. If the All Maker favors us, we will eat well for many days. The wise hunter is cautious, always. I guess the Burnsbergen distracted you too much to care about the Natch. Uh, suppose I'll sleep in Rodolf's house. Uh, what happened to my Dramora? <laughs> You're still not attacking the Natch. Then I won't either. If they're attacking it, it 
is more of a matter of not letting it suffer too much. But That landed awkwardly. Oh, I think I had a... Really? Right, I dumped a lot of stuff here last time. Uh, am I out of... No, I have the apple pies. But... Oh, you respawn too. Uh, Over here. There's the bedroll. Honestly, probably stamina. Oh, I even have a perk and spent. Definitely getting that. Yeah, going to reach 40 in no time. Oh, uh, maybe I should have saved it for... <laughs> yeah, heavy armor is right about to ding. Mm. Uh, I'll just go with it. Anyway, um videos long enough so I will end it here. Thank you for watching and I will see you soon.